I'm ready. What up? Let's get to it. So will the Minnesota Vikings offensive line hold them back again? Watching the preseason game, judging the, the offensive line, only you do. Why was he re-signed? Once again, let me repeat. Why was he re-signed? He looked sloppy on that field. He looked soft. He played piss poor. The whole O-line played piss poor. I hope that the first string is much better. I mean much better than what we've been seeing the whole preseason, bro. It has been piss poor performances. No excuses. Now, this has been years on top of years where the Vikings offensive line have been the weakest link. And I'm definitely worried about them being the weakest link once again. If they cannot protect Kirk, keep him upright, what does it matter? Last season, all season, even in the good games when they performed well, they performed just well. That's what it was. It was all right. It was okay. It was never great. Let's not forget that. It was never great. You never saw a great performance from the Vikings O-line. You haven't seen that in one game in years. Four plus years, baby. Let's just talk facts. Let's just talk real, man. The offensive line is the weakest link. I don't believe in none of the backups. None of the backups, man. They've been getting washed all offseason. Every joint practice, every preseason game, the Titans ate heavy. The Titans ate heavy. When does it stop, man? You tell me they don't sign Dalton Rizna? They cool with Ali Udo? Why is he in the building? Blake Brandell? Looks like he took a step back. You understand? Who is Chris Reed? Who is any of them? I hope the Vikings know what they're doing. I hope that old line first shrink can do something. Because guess what? It's going to be the same circumstances, same situation for the Vikings like we've seen over the years, man. Versus the elite competition, elite of the elite, best D lineman, playoff time, trenches, physicality. They will get washed up again. I mean, washed up again. When do they nip this in the bud? When do they address the problem, man? <laughs> Period. And guess what? No longer is Kevin O'Connell and coaches, staff, etc. absolved from this situation. No, they do not get absolved from the blame. They get majority of the blame. They know their personnel. It's their job to know their personnel, to learn their personnel. And you mean to tell me the whole offseason they believed in this old line? They have trust in this old line? Garrett Bradbury in the middle, Ed Ingram, Ezra Cleveland? Come on, man. Come on now. The backups, let's not ever, 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 ever talk about the backups for the Vikings. You might as well leave them on the bench because guess what? If the Vikings face injury, oh, it's going to be trouble, trouble. Rest in peace, Bernie Mac, true legend. But man, come on, bro. How long will this continue to affect the Vikings? <laughs> you can have all the skilled players you want to. If you can't throw to them, if Kirk has no time, what does it matter? I'll repeat, what does it matter? <laughs> This is getting crazy, man. <laughs> it's been too many years. It's been the weak link. It's been the weak point. Held the Vikings back. Held the Vikings back. Saw it versus the Giants. Dexter Jackson. Ate all night. Ate all day. Every damn game. Every big game, man. They do not hold up. So my question is, what will the Vikings do? How will they improve, dog? They better sign Dalton Rizna or somebody just to get a body in there. Because it looks ass, piss poor, atrocious, dog. I'm tired of seeing it. I don't care if it's just a preseason. Guess what? Those same guys, majority of them, will be on the field regular season, dog. Then what? If someone's injured, guess what? They'll be filling in. The same guys you saw on the field tonight. Come on, bro. I'm tired of the nut riding. Let's keep it real deal. No holy field, but respect holy field. He is a boxing legend. You understand? So, yes, you ask me right now at this moment, the Vikings biggest, weakest link is still the offensive damn line, bro. Hands down, man down. <laughs> they better be lucky they got Jettas. You understand? They better be lucky they got Jettas. Period, man. I'm tired of this. They play soft. They they're not physical, bro. Come on, man. Get some guys in the building who are capable of playing football. Score Vikes.